full details in the blog post linked in the description. The blog post will be kept up to date with any new details that appear. You're running on unstable Wi-Fi signals. For AirPlay to stream media smoothly from an Apple device to your Apple TV, it requires a stable Wi-Fi signal. So, unstable Wi-Fi may break the connection to AirPlay. Instead, you need a network that provides enough strength for the stream to run uninterrupted. Restarting and stabilizing Wi-Fi To get a stable connection, try restarting your Wi-Fi by turning off the router and pulling it from the power source. Let it cool down a bit for 30 seconds to register the router as offline before plugging it back in and switching it on. Once done, try reconnecting your AirPlay to your Apple TV. Wall interference is in the way. If your iPhone is sending data from a different room than your Wi-Fi router and TV, the wall in between could block the signal. Setting all devices in range to get rid of wall interference. We recommend having the sending device, iPhone, iPad, etc., in the same room as the TV and the router. However, placing your iPhone or TV too close to the router can also cause connection problems. A distance of about one foot is good enough in most cases. Your device's software is outdated. Another reason that might be causing disconnection problems between AirPlay and Apple TV is outdated iOS. Since iOS is the operating system that runs several Apple products, such as iPhones, iPads, and iPods, you can expect more trouble than just connectivity issues. Keeping up with software updates. Updating your Apple TV and iOS devices is pretty much the same. Just go to Settings, then press System. Then, go to Software Updates and get those downloads started. To cut the hassle in the future, you can automate the process by turning on automatic update. Your iOS device's resolution is different from the TV's. If your iOS device's resolution is different from the TV's, chances are AirPlay won't run properly. Also, it's worth mentioning that attempting to play back content with high resolution might also result in disconnection problems. Matching the screen formats. Read more. Apple TV color balance not working. To adjust and reduce your Apple TV's display resolution, just go to settings. From there, choose video and audio, and then choose format to make the needed adjustments. You're using an application that isn't AirPlay compatible. Although AirPlay caters to a wide range of apps, it's not universal. So trying to send media through an unsupported app will only result in connection issues. Working around unsupported apps. There isn't much that you can do here, but look for an alternative app that is compatible with AirPlay. Odds are you'll find something else to keep you entertained. Your device is on sleep mode. Usually, iOS devices go to sleep when they are left idle for a certain period. Streaming videos, images, and audio from a device that went into sleep mode will also cause the AirPlay to disconnect from Apple TV abruptly. Deactivating sleep mode. To make sure you'll enjoy uninterrupted viewing, you can deactivate your device's sleep mode altogether. You can turn it off by accessing the control center and tapping the bed icon. You're using a faulty ethernet cable. Apple TV also functions using an ethernet cable. This hardwired setup is said to be more stable than a wireless connection. However, damaged and loose cables can backfire. Resolving Ethernet Connectivity Issues To reduce cable problems, make sure that both ends are connected tightly to the ports and that nothing is pressing on the wire. Meanwhile, if the cable itself is faulty, you'll need to replace it with a reliable one. If you are still having trouble, try seeing if there are any solutions in the comments. I will also update the blog post, linked in the description, with any new fixes that appear.